This is uh, just insane, truly insane. Hi, I'm Seppi, and today we're trying each other's Five Guys orders. When would I usually eat Five Guys? When I am feeling like a rich woman. Five Guys ain't cheap, you know. I think once you see it, you have to have it because you just know what it tastes like and you're like, yes, I need that in my life right now. I think one thing I wouldn't order from Five Guys is like double patty. Like, it's too much. Like, it's way too much. A single patty is enough. I would never order a hot dog. I don't see the point in a hot dog. That's not for me. Anyone else that's done that, I'm going to be, yeah, mildly disturbed. I think the hot dog meat from Five Guys is so good. It's so flavorful. It's going to be a zero from me. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. That's enough talking, I'm ready to eat. So my typical order is, it's a lot, so open your ears. I normally have the normal fries and a salted caramel shake. I like the double patty bacon cheeseburger. Pickles, I like onions, tomatoes, and then I feel like ketchup is different, completely different to tomatoes. Two different things, twice the fun. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> double patty. Oh, my stomach. A double patty and no Cajun seasoning on the fries, which is a bit disappointing. But maybe ketchup will save the day. Always, always does. Oh, that is big. Woo! Mm, the pickle. No, that pickle was just straight, straight in there. I'm overwhelmed with pickle. Overall, it's a decent burger. It's got enough cheese in it because it's double. I thought maybe the double patty might throw me off, but I've got that mouth big enough for it, so it's fine. But do I have the stomach for it? I don't know. It's, that was the old me. There's a problem. This, look, when I bite, I push. Then everything. <laughs> it's big. It's, it's not what I would choose. But yeah, I enjoyed the chips. Boring. I'm sorry, totally boring. I take back what I said earlier about the double patty. I'm actually here for that. I really like the double patty. Okay, I'm excited. I've not had the salted caramel shake from Five Guys. We're friends, mate. This is this is a good... When you select this milkshake, you know what's going on. Like, there's so many options. Why would you not at least mix two things? Like, you could have put some Biscoff in that. Let's try the shake. Oh, man, it's good. <laughs> oh! Mm. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> that's good. I think that's better than my shake. That is good. I, I, I feel like, did I, did I slag this off quite hard? Yeah, I think I made some mistakes. That was, that was good. That's good. Oh, damn. I'm gonna give it a 7.5. Definitely a 7.5. So I would give this order a seven out of 10. I'm gonna have to give this order an eight. So my typical order is the cheese dog with grilled onions. I've got jalapeno peppers in there. Obviously you've got to have the Cajun fries and obviously a peanut butter shake. Ooh. Oh God, <laughs> no, 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 <laughs> that is just, <laughs> this is the worst. I've never had a hot dog from Five Guys and I've never seen anyone else eat one. So this is a brand new experience for me. It does look a bit weird, a bit sorry for itself. So I'm not really keen on the Cajun fries from Five Guys. Why do you think they put this order together? To sort of end the possibility of world peace ever happening. That's why they put this order together. A person who wants to see good in the world would not, would not order this. It has been time since I've had these. You're changing your mind now, huh? I mean, they're okay. My first, my initial thoughts is just like artificial. Like it doesn't taste real. And I just think that's because I refuse to believe that Five Guys sell hot dogs. It's not coming together as much as I thought it would. It's not, it's just meat. It's not that bad. I just feel like I need to make it my way to enjoy it. Oh, I mean, I, yeah, I, I, I was gonna lie and kind of say that I could enjoy that, but I, yeah, no, that's not enjoyable. It's a bit boring, let's be honest, sorry. It is. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. Milkshake time. No, don't want that. What? I hate peanut butter. Oh, it's got bits. Oh, oh, oh. It's actually pretty good. <laughs> if you like Reese's peanut butter, then this is for you. This is good, like by itself it's good. It's, it's nice, I'd, I'd say hi to it if I saw it in the street, but like 
it's not enough for me to want to go for a drink with it. The milkshake pulls it back. I'm going to give it a six. I'll give this order a five out of ten. This order would be better for me if it just didn't exist. That would make this better for me because I'd sleep better at night knowing that other people weren't ordering this. I would give this a generous five. My typical Five Guys order is a bacon cheeseburger, but with just one patty. And then I'm having Cajun fries and then a vanilla and Oreo milkshake. Everyone's loving the milkshakes. I've never had this, this milkshake before, the vanilla and Oreo. So I wonder if it comes anywhere near to my salted caramel. It feels a bit plain, just lettuce and ketchup. You need something more than that. I think it's a pretty like standard burger order. Looking a little, little, little flat. I mean, I'm sure it's very nice actually, but yeah, oh, come on. Oh man, it just, it looks lonely. I just think it can be elevated a bit more. I already know it's going to need that. Mmm, okay. good. I mean, it is nice. It's very good, but it's just missing something, you know? So dry. It's a little bit dry. Just a little bit dry. Maybe some more ketchup or some relish or some juice from the onions and a pickle. It's like a jazz band without the saxophone. I think it is really dry. It's actually hard to swallow, that's how dry it is. Well, yeah, let me try to make the milkshake. Perfection. Absolute perfection. Oh, it's a bit sweet. Mm. Oh, wow. So there are like bits of Oreo in it. This is very vanilla for a uh, Oreo milkshake. I know it's vanilla and Oreo, but it's... Can't really dip the Cajun fries in the, the milkshake. But I love, I love dipping it. But nothing's going to stop me, so... What? Fries and milkshake equals beautiful. It's like... Uh... I'm sorry. It doesn't even come close. Waste your money, girl! I'm going to have to give it a four. I'd give this order a 7.5 out of 10. It is very plain and basic, and the burger's a bit dry. So I'm going to give this a 6 out of 10. My Five Guys order is a little cheeseburger with ketchup, lettuce, grilled onions, relish, and pickles. And a side of Cajun fries and a salted caramel milkshake. You've got to have that. That's just like... I love it's like a little, little small, small burger. And I like that. That's great. I think that's perfect because I know this is going to fill me up to like the perfect level. It looks good. It pretty much looks similar to mine, but I wouldn't order the Cajun just because I don't personally like them that much. I'm a bit wary of the pickles. I'm not sure I'm going to enjoy that, but you know, you cannot go wrong with the Cajun fry. I'm actually quite pleased with this. I, I, I must say, this is looking like it's going to be quite, quite juicy. Ooh, okay. Oh, this is giving me like bougie McDonald's energy. I like it. I like it a lot. Mmm. Oh my god, that's so good. <laughs> a symphony of flavours. One word. Classic. Timeless. This is a timeless burger. I've never been a pickle person. But this is really good. Really good. It's just good. What more can I say? It's just a good order. I haven't tried this though. Ooh. Yeah. I need to reassess my Five Guys order. This order, why am I getting emotional? Yeah, this order is making me think I'm not doing things right. I would definitely consider ordering this in the future. I think it's like a more refined version of mine and I like it. It's really good. It's nothing new. It really isn't anything new. But that's, I think, why we, we love it, because we know it's going to deliver. So it's the way forward. So everyone else, take notes. I would rate this order a 9 out of 10. A 9? I'm going to go with an 8.5. No, no, no. <laughs> From what I tried today, there's no way those orders would have beaten mine. I'm not surprised, yeah. That's, that's really painful to my chest. I'm not going to change. So, there you go. <laughs> if you enjoyed this video, make sure to check out the others on our channel and let us know in the comments what other sort of takeaway stuff should we do.